it's Jeff Schwartz, and we're bringing the piggy bank back. If you're trying to save money, sometimes you just got to go back to the basics. Remember as children, we used to save using a piggy bank? You'd hear the sound of the coins hitting the bottom with a nice little clank. But more importantly, it was almost impossible to get that money out. In some cases, you literally had to break the bank. The reality is millions of Canadians are knee deep in debt. And one of the reasons is we've given up on savings. When life happens and you incur unexpected expenses, or even if these expenses are expected but you haven't planned for them, you will end up in debt. The beauty is that you can start small and change these deep-seated behaviors. First, go out and get that piggy bank. I'm waiting, go get it. They're out there. Just make sure it's tough to get the money out once it's in there. You can start by emptying your change from your pockets each morning and dropping it in the bank. By starting each day in this way, we are paying ourselves first. So guys, I'm waiting. Okay, now let's move into the 21st century. This time, we're going to set up an automatic deduction from each paycheck that goes directly into a savings account. Remember, start small so you don't even notice it's gone. You can always increase the amount. To make this even more real, set a goal. Start by creating an emergency or rainy day fund equal to about three to six months of your expenses. That way, if life happens, you don't have to go into debt to pay for it. Remember, every little bit helps, and the theory behind it is simple. Every little bit helps. Remember this. <laughs> you gotta stop. Go.